Hello everyone, so today I have this fresh box of Modern Masters 2015. I don't know, should I open it or should I not open it? Mm, beautiful! To be honest, I waited till the release of Masters 25 um, with the opening of this box because I wanted to, 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 to see or wait what kind of reprints are in a new set, but I think now is a good time to open this box. It is not a good idea to just wait and, and, and hope to that the prices for Max Opal or whatever will get higher and higher. Um, yeah, so let's just do this. If I get nothing good, then it should be. Then probably I will never ever buy a box again. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, this set is so amazing. It is so amazing. Masters 25 is just really, really nice. So, yeah. The thing about this set, you see you got these packages in here. And these packages are not like normal boosters. They have this paper thing around them. So, uh, let's see what we got in here. Whoop, 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 whoop. I can throw away. So these, these boosters are amazing. They are really amazing. I love them. Yeah, uh, cards that could be in here are Noble Herox, of course, Khans, Mox Opal. And let's get started to the first one. Oops, say, um, put them out here. And we, okay, okay, we're gonna start here. So, I will get through the commons, of course. Oh, nice, Duxtil Citadel, that is pretty dope. And we start with Incandes. Incandescent Soulstoke, okay. Uh, this patch. A cranial plating, nice. And the rarest Thunderblast. And the foil is a Skyreach Manta. Uh, Thunderblast is a uh, creature elemental 7 2 for 5 mana. Thunder Haste. Thunderblast has trample as long as it has a minus minus 1 counter on it. Persist. When this creature dies, if it had no count minus minus one counter on it, return it to the battlefield on its controllers. Okay, that's nice. That one is nice. And we put the foil over here, and we put the, this one over here, and just some nice hits here. Good. Next one. <clears throat> so I'm gonna show you all these packages, how I open them, because a lot of people are saying it is possible to kind of fake these openings with, um, you can open this, this, these packages and just watch what's in it and then fake it. Yeah, uh, not gonna do this. <laughs> so, Algae Gariel, Rectus Carnarium, uh, Celestia Guild Mage, looks pretty nice. And the rare is, a goil, <laughs> a goil, goil. Uh, six mana uh, elemental incarnation. This logo or this symbol looks kind of fake. Okay, Gil can't be blocked by except by three or more creatures. If a spell or ability you control would counter a spell, instead exile that spell and you may play that card without playing its mana cost. Nice! When Gil is put into a graveyard from anywhere, shuffle it into your own library. This is a good card. And the rare is, oh, a foil is, of course, a Mystic Snake. Mm -hmm. But this one is pretty nice. A Guil? <laughs> How am I saying that? Guil? Guil? Good, whatever. So, next package. Please give me a Max Opal. Today is so beautiful out uh, uh, here in Austria. It's sunny. Um, good. We're of course fastening up everything. Yes, and there is an expedition map that is pretty dope. Restless operation. 
Um, culling days. And the rare is a skewed mop. And the foil is a bone splinters. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Good, nice to have this foil. And skewed mop. At the beginning of your upkeep, if you control five or more lands, part of uh, put four plus one plus one counters on skewed mob. Nice! These cards are pretty amazing in this set. Again, another another really good creature. Um arrest again. Two and we have a core duelist. We got Pylori the of the Sleepless. This is reprinted in Masters 25. We got a motor pot. Okay, and we get a spell guide. Nice spell guide. Yeah, pay, pay one mana or two life, change a target of target spell or ability to spell guide. Pretty nice card. It is a little bit not so good printed over here. And the foil is Dusk Hunter Bat. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. A lot of cool cards in this box. Maybe I never ever will get a box for this good price. I paid 200 euros. That is just fair. And yeah, we will see what we get in here. So we got a Mir Smith. We got a Norwegian Sages, I have no idea. Another motor pad, and we got a Nobilis, Nobilis of War. Pay five mana, flying, attacking creatures you control, get plus two, plus zero. This is, this is cool. And I got a Scatter of Seeds. This one is already a little bit damaged over here. Okay, interesting. Um, We put that one over here, and that one over here. So, ay ay ay. So good. So far, so good. Telling time. And the gut shot, of course, is also a nice card. Bloodshot Trainee. Boros Swift Blade. And Ever Flowing Jealous. And the rare is the Lodestand Golem, of course. Non-artifact spells cost one more to cast them. And the foil is an expedition map. Nice! Nice! That one is cool. I think an expedition map is... Yeah, I already got two of them. That is nice. Uh, it is played in, in uh, all the... Um, Tron decks. This is cool forecast. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And resembling skeleton. A lightning bolt. Nice. And the lore scale cuttle. And the rear is a creekwood leech. It is also really bad printed over here. Other black creatures you control get plus one plus one. Other green creatures, the same. At the beginning of your upkeep, you may put a one one black. And green one creature token onto the battlefield. Not a bad card. And a plucked Rusalka or Rus yeah, Rusalka. Sounds kind of Russian. So let's get into the next package. Please give me a Max Opal or a Noble Hirak. Sundance. So uh, we got a Bloodshot Trainee again. A Gruel Turf, an Etched Oracle, and the rare is... <gasps> nice! Perfect, got my first Max Opal. That is pretty nice. That is dope. And I got a Ether Snipe, also not a bad card. And Max Opal. Mmm, love this card. Love this card. Amazing. I should shout now that my girlfriend knows I got a nice card. Amazing. So the first the first awesome hit. And yeah. Maybe I thought this this could be a god box. There are videos like for every box in the internet is always a video like, oh my god, I got a god box. I only pulled I pulled 
all the mythics two times. So Celestial Perch, not a bad, not a bad card. Um, Daggerclaw Imp, Spectral Procession, and the rare is a Shadow Mage Infiltrator, of course. I, this card is reprinted in, in Masters 25-2, and I'm not sure if it's even a rare or now. And a foil Demir Aqueduct. Cool. Can play that card in my power deck. Um, yeah, Shadow Mage Infiltrator. I fear this creature can't be blocked except by artifact creatures and or black creatures. Mm -hmm. Whenever Shadow Mage Infiltrator these combat damage to a player, you may draw a card. It's a good card. It is a good card. It is a good, 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 good card. So, and what do we got here? We got uh, nothing super interesting. So, and we got a Golgari Road Farm. And we got a Dispatch again. And we got a Palaka Worm. And we got a Ant Queen. Mm hmm. Uh, 5 mana, 5-5, five, five, pay 2, put a 1-1 one, one green insect creature token onto the battlefield. And the foil is a kite sail! Ooh, nice! A kite sail foil! Uh, yeah, Ant Queen is, yeah, good, but yeah. Yeah. So it is okay, right? I'm super happy that I already pulled this, this, this Max Opal. It's amazing. Burst Lightning, um... Telling time again. Uh, Wines of Vastwood. I think this is also reprinted, right? A Frogmite. And the first uncommon is Boros Garrison. Cool. Can play that too. Ah, nice. Dismember. And the Restless Operation again. And the foil is Eye of Ugin. That is pretty nice. Eye of Ugin. And the foil is. A mute enforcer can play that in power part two. Uh, but Eye of Ugin is colorless Eldrazi spells you cast cost two less to cast. That is pretty nice. Eye of Ugin. And yeah, seven, search your library for a colorless creature card, reveal it, and put it onto your hand. Then shuffle your library. This is amazing. I got two awesome cards already. Um, yeah, the good thing about this set is. Everything you're pulling in the set is, or there are a lot of possible hits. Uh, you get cards which are really heavily or really much played in modern and other um, other games too. Oh my god, <laughs> I'm super nervous right now because this box was so expensive. Uh, Dimmer Aqueduct, Overhelm. Hothfire Hobo Goblin looks pretty cool. And the rarest. Oh. Guys, sometimes I love this game so much. And Emrakul, the Ains of uh, Thorn. I think I don't have to read it because it's just an amazing card. And I got a Thrumming Bird, whatever that is. But I got an Emrakul Ains of Thorn. This is nice. This is nice. This is the, it is the third really, really amazing hit. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Thanks to this guy in the United States who sent me this box to Europe. Thank you, thank you, thank you, dude. This box is really, um, already amazing. It is amazing. Wayfarer's bubble. And yeah, this is just nice. Artisan of Kozilek. Another cranial plating. A shrewd hatchling looks really badass. And I got a Mirren Crusader. And I got a Knowledge Pack. Mirren Crusader, pay free mana. They are really bad printed over here. Double strike, protection from black and from green. Nice card. I got an Emrakul, a Max Opal, and an Eye of Ugin. Mm, Eye of Ugin. Eye of Ugin. That is nice. So I got another Thrumming Bird. Whatsoever. Um, 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 um. Yes, a remont. I was looking for that cut too. Um, a Boros Garrison and Wing and a Wengeful re Rebirth. And the rear is an Apocalypse Hydra. And the foil is a Storm Blue Berserker. An Apocalypse Hydra. Yeah, play X, uh, red, green. Apocalypse Hydra and also benefit with X, 
plus one plus one counters on it. If X is five or more, it enters the battlefield with an additional uh, uh, plus one plus one counter. Remove it and you can deal damage to that creature player. Mm, nice, nice card. Pretty nice card. And I get, yeah, a Stormblood Berserker. Um, yeah. Um, so, what do we get here? This card again. And anything super exciting? Tell me that. Ah, not a Dark Steel. Um, Citadel, that is cool. Um, the Warring Greed. The Norwegian thing again, Sages. I got an Etched Oracle again. And the rare is Andrex, our Master Breeder. Nice! And I got a Kami of Ancient Law. These cards are already banning. Mm, okay. So, get quicker, get quicker. I think it's okay when this video takes a little bit more time, because, guys, this is just really a big, a big um, investment for me. This, this one looks pretty cool, the, the whole card. Um, it's a big investment for me, and it's not... Like every day I'm, I'm opening a box like this. So yeah, I take my time. Uh, Krumudlax, looks cool. Uh, Necrogenesis, uh, Celestia Sanctuary, nice. And the rear is a Kiki Chiki, Kiki Chiki Mirror Breaker. Mmm, a mythic, cool, 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 cool. Yes, it is haste and put token that's a copy of target non-legendary creature you control onto the battlefield. That token has haste, sacrifice it at the beginning of the next dance that. Cool, cool card. And a Waxman Baku. <laughs> This is a cool, this is a cool card too. I mean, it's also, uh, it's my, my third mythic, my third mythic. This is cool. This is really good. This is really nice. Really nice. Really nice. Really nice. Really nice. And the next package, what do we get in here? A frogmite, it's another frogmite. Um, Sito Blast, Rootkin. A mool drifter, of course, can use that one in my power deck. Watch, look, uh, look my video, watch my video about power decks. Deck tech, mool drifter, nice card. And agony warp, of course, can use that too in my power deck. And <laughs> this is just amazing. And now I realize that I'm really um, dirty here. I don't know why, but noble hero, seriously, <gasps> ah, I love that one. The price of this card um, really were 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 um, going up because it wasn't it wasn't re uh, reprinted. So yeah, one mana zero one creature human druid exalted. Whenever creature you control attacks alone, that creature gets plus one plus one until end of turn, and you can tap it and you can uh, cast that kind of re mana. This card is just amazing. Oh my god! Oh my god! I was. So so nervous about this box, but right now I have to say everything I wanted, I already got it. Um, this is this is just awesome. This is just, just, just awesome. Not a gut shot. Yes. So um, a scavenger Drake. Is it boiler works? I came in like a wrecking ball. And the rare is a Hellkite Charger. Uh, and a Smoke Breeder. That looks cool. That's a cool foil. Uh, Hellkite Charger. Yeah, pay six. It's a little expensive. Flying Haste. Whenever Hellkite Charger attacks, you may pay the same amount of mana. If you do, untap all attacking creatures. And after this phase, there is an additional combat phase. Nice! A nice card. Pretty nice, solid card. So. Whew. What unbox opening. What unbox opening. Oh my god. Oh my god. What is that? Uh, oh my god. So. Spread the sickness. Dimir Guildmage. This thing is also reprinted, right? I'm not sure. Dimir Guildmage. A spite belows. And. And Iona Shield of Emeria. <laughs> of course, another mythic. Why why not? Flying as Iona Shield of Emeria enters the battlefield, chose a color. 
Your opponent can't cast spells of chosen colors. Nine mana. Pretty nice card. And I got a Dark Steel Citadel in foil. Of course. Of course. <laughs> this is just. Ah! What a box. What a box, guys. What a box. This is just nice. This is just pretty nice. Uh, wait for us. Bubble again. And we are starting with an Elge Gadiel. An expedition map, of course. Take that one. And I got an Evercase knight. Looks also cool. And the rare is Splinter Twin. And the foil is a Vampire Lacerator. Lacerator Lec Lec looks cool. And Splinter Twin, Enchant Creature. It is really bad printed. I have kind of a mark here. Okay. And Chan Creature has, yeah, put a token that's a copy of this creature onto the battlefield. That token has haste, excited at the beginning of the next uh, and step. They are all like really bad printed here, over here. But it's okay. Take that one. Why not? I think the price of Splintered Twin is also going up. Because so many people waited for reprints in Masters 25, but no, no way, no way. Wizards of the Coast, no way. Kite Sail again. And yeah, is it Boiler Works, uh, Scavenger Drake, Agony Warp again, and I got a Necro Skitter. Of course. Wither, this deals damage to creatures in the form of minus one, minus one counters. Whenever a creature and opponent controls with a minus one, minus one counter on it dies, you may return that card on the battlefield under your control. <laughs> nice card! And I got an Apostle's Blessing. Cool, cool looking. Look, look at this. Also a good card. And my last free packs. My last free packs. Where is my Karn? Where is my Karn? This, this would be, oh my god, if I got a Karn too. Nobody will ever believe that. Another dark steel? Is it is it really that much? Um in the, okay. Water servant. An oblivion ring, of course. Good card. Boros Swift Blade. And the rare is a white leaf leech. Cool. Other green creatures got plus one plus one. And other white creatures got plus plus one plus one. And it's the same um ability as the other thing in black green, I think. And an Ashen Moor. Goucher. Um, haven't got a rare or a mythic in foil. This is okay. I, I mean, I got super cool hits already in this box. This is amazing. And another kite sail, of course. Take that one. Bloodshot trainee again. Tai Nar Swordsmith. An air seven servant. And a long forgotten, go high. Arcane spells you cast, cost one less to cast. Spirit creatures you control, got plus one plus one. Don't know that, sorry, but I can't remember that card. And the foil is commune with the nature. Okay, my last package. So, my foil Karn, I think he's, he's now waiting in this box, right? I think he's just waiting to, to get pulled. Hope so. So, Stormblood, Berserker, Deathmark. Ow, that looks really hurtful. And a Wangeful Rebirth. And the rare is an Etched Monstrosity. Of course, an Etched Monstrosity. And Necrogenesis in foil. So, um, yeah, Edge from Small Monstrosity it enters the battlefield with 5 minus 1 minus 1 counters on it. Pay all 5 colors, remove 5 counters from Edge Monstrosity. Target player draws 3 cards. Cool! I got a lot of awesome hits. And Noble Hyrax, seriously, it's too, too amazing. And Amra, cool. And Ive Ugin. And of course, a Max Opal and an Ash Monstrosity. I got a lot of um, um, other cool cards. I will summarize all this stuff up 
and I will make a short video where I can show you the, the worth I got in this box. So if you like the videos, please like them and subscribe to my channel. And yeah, it was an amazing opening. Hope to see you guys soon again. And of course, have a nice day. Bye.